So, uh, Russia recently increased their uh, global threat level by running a test of their intercontinental ballistic nuke. Oh, shit. Uh, guess what that nuke is called? What's the name of that missile? The Hasbulla. <laughs> the big... <laughs> the Hasbulla. Big Hasbulla. It's, it's tiny, but, it, but mighty, bro. Oh. Tiny, but mighty is a nice name. Putin's okay. penis? Yeah. Putin's penis. <laughs> Putin boom? Putin boom. <laughs> That's pretty good. Now, yeah. what would like a Russian guy name it? Uh, I don't know. Peace. Peace. <laughs> peace. <laughs> I'm going to send peace, peace now. The world. Yeah. Oh. It's actually called the Satan Two. Oh, the Satan. oh yeah. that's a sick name. That's actual Satan. Bro. Gangster oh. as fuck, dude. Satan yeah. Two. Satan Two. So does that mean like the that's rest Hellfire, of the bro. world is like, what the fuck is going on? No, that's the thing that's weird. Is that um. Every the rest of the world generally is like, he's just flexing, that's a normal test you have to do anyway. They're I feel like, like they always say that. Yeah, but yeah. that's, I think, like obviously they're gonna submarines. say something that won't make everyone panic, you yeah. know? That's very true. But this missile has a range of 11,200 miles and it has enough power to erase France. But wow. can it reach America? Yeah. <laughs> why, why do they gotta choose, why do they gotta pick oh, up no. France? I always think, <laughs> like, if they were to do nukes, if they hit New York, you know what I mean? Like, New York is a hot target. I mean, it's right there on the coast. Yeah. It's like the closest thing people. here. But it probably goes New York, New Jersey. Like, how, what's the size of France in that? Oh, bro, you're New knocking York. out that entire, know. like... But it's yeah. fucking all of New England. Yeah, so it's not technically a nuclear missile, but it's nuclear capable. So they could just put a nuclear warhead inside of it. And it's said to be the world's longest range intercontinental ballistic missile. Man, we would not see He it. also we brags that? that there's no current defense system that can... Targeted. Whoa. That's kind of scary. Elon, please help us, yeah. dude. Yeah. But then the US oh. described the testing as routine and dismissed any global. Thing. They always do that, though. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Who said that? Jen Saki? My girl, <laughs> Jen Psaki. That's his girl, dude. That's my girl, dude. What if the US is like, man, that's why we've been having a space force, fool? You don't even know what we got. Oh. Yeah, see, that was that's what my question was. Like, what's up with the space force? They've been real quiet, so maybe they're just like. Yeah, they're, they're moving in hard. silence. They're moving in, I like it. I kind of like it. Yeah, space might, force. Maybe they'll like. Uh, intercepted from out of space. From the moon. Oh. Yep. Whoa, that'd be tight. Yeah, so if fully armed, it really actually says it can deliver a payload big enough to destroy an area the size of France. France is pretty big. <laughs> so they mean, we're France. gonna blow up France next. <laughs> I mean, out of all France. the European countries though, France is 210,000 <laughs> square Paris, miles. You know? Everywhere else is, please keep beautiful <laughs> France, but Paris is okay. Uh, you could hit Paris. So remember when Putin said like, oh, if anyone like fucks with us, you'll, you'll experience a level of like destruction that the history has never seen. Yeah, yeah, I remember he said that. Bro, yeah. Satan too. That's yeah. fucking. That's, that's a crazy dope. name. Can't wait for the third one. Bro. I hope not. Yeah, that's yeah, why yeah, I'm like, let's get this crazy. video out before be... people fucking go. How insensitive of you to make a video of the fucking after it <laughs> after he <laughs> fucking <laughs> blows up oh, France. Oh jeez, oh, yeah. oh. it's high stakes here. Well, I mean, damn, it's getting harder to do our job as comedy. That is know? wait, eleven thousand <laughs> miles. You said that's how far it goes. It can travel. Can we measure how far is 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 Russia from here? from New York City. How far? 1,100 miles or 11,000? Wow, that's fucking far. Five. Oh, dude, that can reach here! It can go double the distance. And then come back around. Can go that shit can fucking like, circle around the globe! Bro, that shit could go to New York and back. <laughs> yeah. Wait, what is the, what is the, what is the mile? Go to New York, flex. Uh, like, New York to back. Russia. Yeah. Lay over in New York. Like I'll just let you all know we're here and then go back. Land, they could do a fucking round trip. Hopefully it does that and just blows itself up. <laughs> <laughs> they miscalculate. It's like, oops, goes back around <laughs> Russia. Have you guys seen the Russian like military scrambling though? Like Ukraine's been whooping their ass. Yeah. So I don't know. I don't really have confidence in their ability. That's a good point. You know, like they have their track record so far shows that like their military is pretty incompetent. That's a good point because they like other countries are saying the reason that he's so public about this test is because Flexible. their recent technology when practiced in war was a failure so far. Mm. Like all the stuff they've been oh. bragging about to this point yeah. has not really worked So this all. one might go like and then it's like, uh oh, malfunction, and it just fall. Yeah, there was this uh, video, it's like these Russian tanks going into Ukraine, they get ambushed, and then these guys, instead of having some sort of like military order, you just seem go, oh fuck, oh shit, yeah. and the fool's <laughs> climbing out of the tanks, oh, get the fuck out! <laughs> It was just fucking a shit show. I'm like, what the? F no, uh, you know what I heard is that some of those guys thought they were in like a training exercise, and they when the when they were getting shot at, they're like, 
what the fuck? We're in war? Yeah, and then yeah, they're, yeah, yeah. they they just all jumped out, started surrendering. How would they jump out of the tank? They're just freaking know. out. Load themselves into the turret. <laughs> Get me out of here. <laughs> here, like, so in the American military, like, the objective and your mission is extremely important because if you're lost from your squad or your platoon or your leaders, you still know what you're supposed to do. Mm. If you're stranded in a jungle, you know exactly what you're supposed to do. Eat banana. Eat banana, right? And then so like that's, they're never going to send you and not tell you what's happening. Mm. You need to have a North Star. So is it bullshit mm. that they didn't know where they were at? Oh no, for them, I don't know what Oh, the, Russians are crazy, possibly. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You just need to rally yeah, as many troops as possible. Big. Totally see them just shipping it out. They're running out of gas, all that. But I, I heard that like a lot of their um, military too didn't have much practice and training. It's been so many years since they took the war shit seriously. Yeah, we've been at war for ever. Yeah. They were so corrupt for the last 40 years of like not really being in wars and shit that they're like, eh, we're not gonna be in a war. So they started selling off the equipment and like awesome. parts and then they weren't redoing the shit. They were building the government. So then like there was this real big corruption in the military where you know how like the military they get funding by government budgets, right? So then they get the government budgets and then like they have to spend it all. So then basically they're like embezzling the government budget and then they'll, they're supposed to buy like let's say new tires or some shit. But instead of buying new tires, they just use the money for other shit or they just fatten up their own pockets. Yeah. Basically. <laughs> like a lot of our spending goes to rehearsals. That's how you stay sharp. We do all those tests. You know, yeah, like 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 every single uh, like marine that comes out of boot camp has shot over a thousand rounds. Wow. And then the fighter jets are doing rehearsals. They're like practicing like dropping missiles, making sure they're hitting targets. So a lot of the mo most of the money is spent on rehearsals and rehearsals and rehearsals throughout your whole career. Yeah, that costs so, so much. So if you're not rehearsing, then they don't they have this surplus of a budget and they still need to spend it. It's but you can clearly tell that they suck. At so does the air force really also have to rehearse like? Ejection from the plane. All of that. Every single. So they'll thing. just let it crash as a rehearsal. Yeah, yeah, they'll it's, have to. It's really. To. I find it really funny that the military calls it rehearsals. I'm calling it rehearsals. Oh, yeah. What they, do they call, call it? it training. Training. Yeah. Rehearsals. I like that better. Yeah. Like, hey, God, you had to go to rehearsal. It's an like acting class. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Stage combat. Yeah, yeah, yeah it's like a plane goes <laughs> and scene. <laughs> The rehearsals. <laughs> yeah, I've been, I've been, I've been in like uh, call call for fire training environments where like uh, like someone like Don mm -hmm. or or another guy like a fire observer like he would be there and he would call in the coordinates to have the planes come in and because the missiles are fucking millions of dollars you'll see we'll rehearse like all day with just uh, the planes coming in and then the next day when it's ready they'll drop the one or two missiles Fuck. so that they don't so they can. Get get the almost like uh, when you're shooting, like you dry fire, right? So you don't waste your bullets. So they'll do all of those reps, and then the next day is when they drop the actual missile. Wow! That's but all that costs money. Rehearsal. That's a lot. Yeah, that's the dress rehearsal yeah, yeah, yeah. right there. So then, did you ever have to? Are there? You know when there's rehearsals for like extraction or like trying to save somebody, and then there's a guy who just plays like a person being saved. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Who are those people? <laughs> they're they're, they're each other. extras. Oh, they're what? They're each other. oh, so you had to do that too? Get them from SAG. Let's say we do it. Let's say we do an evacuation uh, drill. He's like overplaying his role. Yeah. I just need you to shut up. Dude. <laughs> bang, you're dead. Bang, you're dead. And then they'll run the scenario. So you two get the chill. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you get to be the dead. <laughs> oh, so you have to really actually be dead weight, huh? Yeah, and you're just bodies like this, and you can't help, even though if you know the answers, or oh. like he's supposed to. It's like to escape help. room? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he yeah. looks up. Do you want a hint? Huh? <laughs> Fuck. Damn, that's tight. I didn't know that. Yeah. You just take turns being the keys in the wall right there. <laughs> it's literally like sports, right? Like you have to run those plays. Oh, running drills over yeah. and over and over, so that when you play the actual team, you know this guy passes the ball to that person, that passes the ball to that person, because it doesn't magically happen. Right. Man, the military is just larping half the time. They are. They're <laughs> larping themselves, to be honest, <laughs> to be ready. But the Russians ain't. Oh, yeah. LARP, how, how much LARPing do they do? That's why like when the shit hits the fan, they're fucking scrambling all over the place. Mm, Yo, have I you know seen LARP. those like spent naz like fucking training videos? Or like they have those like Russian military like special forces videos. It looks so dope, dude. 
And then the reality is, that where the fuck did those guys go? Yeah, where are those guys at? They've been in the, I mean, they've been in the war for a minute now, and I'm surprised yeah. they didn't even, because I heard in the beginning, they're like, oh, no, what they're doing is Russia just sending in their shit troops to tire out Ukrainians, mm -hmm. and then they're going to bring in the badasses. Do you think that's a possibility? Mm -hmm. then, but look at how long it's been. I don't know, man. We it, PS5s are still sold out, bro. Yeah, for real. It takes forever. <laughs> yeah, for they thought they were gonna like shut them down in like 48 hours or something. They're like, Ukraine, a tiny ass country. Yeah, they were bragging about that. And then, hell no. Nah. But also, they have so much uh, foreign support. Like, Ukraine has yeah, all of that's true. our like funding. I feel like they're always saying they don't have enough to like outlast. Mm. Didn't we just yeah. give them like like two two point five trillion dollars or some shit. Yeah. They got a lot of Bitcoin and shit, all that. All Elon gave fundies. them fucking what is that thing? Skylink or Skylink Internet? Yeah, yeah bro. They're hooked Damn. up. We ain't even got Skylink. I know. Yeah. Give us Come Skylink. On, Elon. <laughs> Trying to watch these TikToks, dog. <laughs> <laughs> I got so many TikToks I gotta watch, man. Come on. Yeah.